Hey YouTube family, happy Friday. Uh, today is uh, January 12th, so it's Friday, TGIF. Um, I took the day off today. My company gives me Monday off, which a lot of people don't get Monday off, um, but I took Monday off. I was going to travel this weekend uh, to see some family, but that end up not working out so I still took my day and um, my little puppy Zaya uh, went to the groomers this morning I kind of left her hair actually I didn't get her any of her hair cut except on her sanitary area and her face because it's, it's kind of chilly here and it's kind of cute to see her with all the hair um, but I definitely know next time that we're she's at the beauty shop which will probably be in a month uh, before Valentine's Day um, she'll get another haircut and then she'll get a real haircut so uh, she got a, a blowout and uh, it, it was so fast usually when she goes to the groomers she's there and it could be because I have no choice but to take her on a Saturday um, she's there from leave it she's there from like 9 10 o'clock all the way, I she's sometimes even been the last kid at daycare, like the last kid at the beauty shop, you know. So today though was was super fast. I say all that today. Say today was super fast. I dropped her off at eight o'clock, and they called me by nine thirty. It was like wow, this is this is great, you know. It just shows that those that get to work remote or retired or have the luxury of taking advantage of week during doing things during the week leave it leave it thank you um it, it just things just go by so much more faster and better yeah so i've had some work done at my house today zaya good girl she's getting better with with listening zaya's only a year old um over a year birthdays in September so it's January so five months six months in so she's she's getting better she's listening so much better than what she used to Shih Tzus are an interesting breed though I well can't speak of all Shih Tzus because she's my first one but I just think that these breeds that like Labradors or you know dogs that are just uh, working breeds they just, they, their recall is better, and and uh, she just kind of, she chooses to listen. That's what I say about Zaya. I thought at first, when I first got her, I thought she was deaf. I didn't know if she could hear or not, because I'd call her, and she, I'd give her a command, and this girl, she do her own thing, honey. So, if I like the little bows, get it, get it, get it, get it, okay, got grass on me, man. I love that little move that she does. She's so interesting how dogs are just um, instinctively kind of know what to do. I guess I'm you know, believing her mommy, or her mom, or her you know, little get his eye, get it, get it, Momo. Um, her, you know, her parents taught her how to do different things because she just knew how to do it. Like, who knows how to like dig up dirt? Um, yeah, but she knows. It's so cool. Come on. So, we're going for a walk. Saya was going through a spell where she was afraid of the dark. She first was afraid of noises. It was right after, right before, same time as Christmas. I think she heard something and it just really freaked her out. Sorry. Really freaked her out. And she didn't even want to go outside. Then she didn't want to go in the backyard she didn't want to do anything she was just just kind of pitiful actually you know and she loved this girl loves her walks this girl went from having three walks on the weekend when it would be me and her to one every day when I get off work to not even wanting to go outside so anyway I'm kind of glad she's over that and now she's brave again come on yes look at you you're so cute you put cute little bows in your hair. I like those bows. She's really not 
that much of a frilly girl, but I like the bows. I think they're super cute. And I'll usually keep them in her hair for, mm, you know, some time. Come on, Zaya. You know, a couple days, and then I'll take them out. But, um, what was I saying? So, yeah, so now she's back walking and being brave. And since I was off today, um, we've been going on. This is her second walk. I have a contractor at my house today working, so. <sighs> you know, it's sharing my space and being a good neighbor. And I need, I need them, right? I hire them, I want them, and I need what they're doing. So I appreciate them. It's just a matter of hurry up and finish and do it and leave. <laughs> you know, so, but that's rude <laughs> and I'm a contractor so you know it's like and then you want quality quality takes time and you want a good price and you know all these things so it's like don't rush this person that's giving you a good price and giving you quality if it takes them however long it takes them let them do it right <laughs> so anyway I say all that to say um anytime you have people in your home you you modify your daily operations you know you're not not doing anything you're just trying to be hospitable and make yourself accept accessible and uh, keep your place accessible and no good girl you're doing so good listening today thank you Zaya your dad what's that what's that what's that baby huh good girl so today it's still kind of chilly here. That's kind of why I also kept Zai's hair on the longer side. Um, morning time, I put a little sweater on her because it's just got a little chill, you know. But now the sun is out. She got a good little blowout. It's all 15 pounds of her. She's <laughs> love this little dog. Everybody loves Zaya. <laughs> Anyway, um, made this channel. She was on, on my uh, YouTube channel, but um, I always wanted to make her own channel so we could I could film adventures of her and maybe share in other toy breed communities as far as learning and fellowshipping. I always have questions, so um, hopefully you'll join and and I can learn from you and maybe you'll share. And um, she loves kids and their kids. I don't want to do that. Come here, Zaya. I don't want to film the kids, but um, yeah, and you guys will share and we can become friends. I hope so. And um, thank you. Okay, have a nice day. Bye.